Okay. This, I've now moved on to the playroom, which again, I have already gotten rid of like three bags of toys, but we just still have way too much. So, I, this is our pile to get rid of, all in that laundry basket. And I'm organizing the toys, and I'm trying to decide what I'm going to put up for our toy rotation. <laughs> so, we'll see. I'll finish getting this all picked up and then I'll show you what that looks like. Ooh. Okay, so here is the playroom. It is not perfect, but all this stuff on the desk here is stuff that I am going to store away. So, and also it has houses to go with it. You know what, it's not gonna fit in that closet. We'll see, I'll figure it out. So. But look, so much neater. We'll see how this goes. All right, I have got six bins of toys to pack away to attempt my toy rotation. Um, I think I'm gonna store it just in my haul linen closet. Um, we'll see if I can get it to fit. I need to reorganize that closet and see if that'll work. Um, that's kind of my thing is where do I store this stuff? I want it to be easy to do because if it's not easy, let's face it, I'm not going to do it. So y'all tell me, do you do a toy rotation? If you do, where do you store the stuff? Tell me in the comments because I'm kind of at a loss. My first thought was the attic, but I don't see that being easy and me rotating the toys. Um, so we'll see. We'll see if the kids even miss this stuff. Maybe they don't and I can kick it to the curb. <laughs> so. But y'all tell me what you do. Um, Cause toys are just overrunning my house, y'all. <laughs> like I gotta get rid of it. 